at this point of time, all the customer satellites have been released and Microsat will be released in about an hour's time after the launch vehicle brings it, the, brings the altitude back to around 350 kilometers. Welcome back. So ISRO has launched successfully its 100th satellite and we have the ISRO chief who's just addressing the media. Let's quickly listen in to what is being said there. We'll follow up on the remaining um, satellite performance and this year we have a large number of activities planned and the next GSLV Mark II is already getting assembled and it's scheduled for launch next month. I would request uh, Kuni Krishnan Director Shar to say a few words on this occasion. Good morning. The calendar of 2018 for ISRO has been opened today with an excellent PSLV mission, as Chairman indicated, a true gift, a New Year gift to our nation. The successful mission of PSLV C40 with Cartosat 2 series and 30 other satellites have proved that ISRO's teamwork once again has given the real dividend. It is truly precious and more sweeter because of multiple reasons. All right, so that is what the scientists immediately after the successful launch of the PSLV C-40 have to say, stating that India has yet again stamped its mark in the world of space technology. It is, of course, a part of the elite club of nations, perhaps about six or seven nations in the world who actually have this technology of putting in satellites into space and what we've done today is that over 32 satellites have been sent to space including the Cartosat satellite which will be used for remote sensing and also for weather forecasting. And the Indian Space and Research Organization has of course created history today. The Polar Satellite Launch Vehicle or the PSLV lifted off at 9.29 a.m. from Sri Harikota in South India, carrying India's 100th satellite along with 30 others. Now, out of the 31 satellites, three are Indian satellites. The other 28 are from Canada, Finland, France, South Korea, the United Kingdom and also the United States. The Indian satellites include the 710 kilogram Cartosat 2 series for the Earth observation, a 100 kilogram micro satellite and also a 5 kilogram nano satellite. The total weight of all satellites on board the rocket is about 1,323 kilograms. The first satellite launch in 2018 in the back of the PSLV C-40 comes four months after a similar rocket failed to deliver the country's eighth navigation satellite in the Earth's lower orbit on the 31st of August 2017. So on the back of that failure, this was a very, very critical launch which ISRO has been able to deliver very successfully. Certainly this is a historic day for us and a great, great headway actually for India and I would say that it is also to a great extent the personal indulgence, personal intervention, the, the kind of inspiration and patronage which was available from Prime Minister Shri Narendra Modi over the last three, four years that one after the other, Team ISRO, the space scientists of India have registered one success after the 